Wexford Tidy Towns uh, is worked with the Wexford Borough Council and with a group of volunteers. Uh, we work in every part of the town. Uh, we paint, we clean up. Litter picking, I suppose, is probably the most obvious part of Wexford Tidy Towns or any tidy towns. But we try to make sure that we're looking at it in a holistic way. That um, we're not just trying to pick up rubbish, we're also trying to get people to stop throwing rubbish down. Well, today is an example of the work that the Tidy Towns does here in, in, in the Roxy Modeling Town. Uh, we go out mostly twice a month, but in the month of April we go out every, every week to, to clear up some place. And today we had a huge number of people out. We work with the local community as far as possible. And today we had the St Mary's in Modeling Town Football Club and they came out in their droves. So we had a really big number and I just got figures back there now. We've got 250 bags of rubbish plus half a ton of miscellaneous items, steel and pieces of rubbish generally. A lot of household rubbish there and also a lot of drink cans. With cutbacks in public services and so on, uh, we're never going to have people to be able to do this, this kind of thing in the future. So we need people to take control of their own areas, look after their own places. And this is what we're seeing today. We need people to do that. And that's, that's it's going to be the future and people that don't do it will have will live in squalor and people that do do it will have their places tidy and neat and, 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 and good places to live. I'm delighted to be here today, um, such a fantastic clean up in, and lovely community to work with. Um, I'm with Antashka and this area, the Borough Council has been designated as a green community since 2011 um, because of the, the great work that they're doing here and their interaction between the actual people that work here and, and live here and the, the businesses and the local Borough Council that have been quite helpful all along the way. Um, they don't just do clean ups, um, they're also interested in the great picture the biodiversity and the, the working on resources they've talks on um, energy conservation on waste management and um, they have this year they have a new biodiversity I've just heard today the new biodiversity uh, subgroup um, looking at the coastline um, and looking at the natural heritage that is here so um, it's a great community to work with it's a beautiful place to come to a beautiful place to live and lovely to, to visit so thanks to these guys for keeping it keeping it that way so if you're looking at this video folks um, we would love you all to join us. It must mean that you really um, are interested in taking part in some of our cleanups. And you can see the fun that we've had today, as well as clearing um, a load of rubbish from the rocks. Whatever you are interested in doing, please come along and let us know your expertise or what you are good at.